before, matter is made of particles. Depending on the state of matter, particles inside an object or substance may be close together or more spread out. When talking about water, it is interesting to observe the behavior of those particles when water is exposed to different temperatures. For this purpose, we will do an experiment that will let us observe the action of those little particles inside water. We are going to use three identical beakers. Beaker 1 will hold very cold water. Then we will place food coloring in the beaker and observe what happens. In cold water, the food coloring spreads very slowly. We can conclude that in cold water, the particles move very slowly. Beaker 2 will hold warm water. Then, we place food coloring in the beaker and observe what happens. In warm water, the food coloring spreads faster than in cold water. We can conclude that in warm water, the particles move a little bit faster. Beaker 3 will hold hot water. Then, we place food coloring in the cup and observe what happens. In hot water, the food coloring spreads very fast. We can conclude that in hot water, the particles move very fast. In summary, if the amount of heat is decreasing or we are lowering the temperature, the particles move slower. If the amount of heat is increasing or we are increasing the temperature, the particles move faster. Colder, slower, hotter, faster. Colder, slower, hotter, faster.